Hey, 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 Gemini. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for my Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Gemini. Oh my gosh. If you would, before you leave, I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you, info's down in the description box below. Make sure you're clicking on that link as there are many tarot card impersonators about the community and know that you'll always see my face at a reading as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever on YouTube. Uh, don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. Holy schmoly. You have the two of cups, the intertwined snakes. You have the lovers, the alchemical heart. You have the devil, the master of lies. And the page of pentacles, the butterfly Sinew Vixen. Sinew? I don't know. Whatever, Vixen. Okay. So, wow. You're definitely coming together with a soulmate that, oh boy. You've got to be careful, okay, that this isn't toxic. Or you've got to know that it's, it's, it's going to be a strong-ass connection. And it's like that line between toxic and not toxic i don't know the devil tempts you um hmm. that'll be interesting to clarify there i mean it could just be a capricorn it could just be hmm. it could be your shadow side you're looking at it could be fear so let's see Tell me about the Two of Cups. What's going on with the Two of Cups in Gemini? The Wheel of Fortune, the Great Wheel. I feel like your luck's about to change. The Knight of Cups, the Brother of the Wild. So there's an incoming offer. Offer incoming. Very romantic uh, gesture here. That's what I'm feeling. Karmic release, the sacred karmic dare. Very interesting. I feel like... It all hinges on this karmic release. It's like something within you needs to be released for space, for this space, for this person. In order for them to come in, you need to release whatever this is, message of concern. Oh, what's this? Toil and labor. What's the message of concern? Occupation. So some of you could be concerned about a job. Or I don't know, like if some of you get laid off or something. But I feel like you're working hard though. Not sure, maybe you work with this person or you meet them through work. I don't know. I wonder why this is showing up. Why is why is this work showing up in this row? I want to know. Courthouse, some sort of decision. Maybe you've got to make a decision between work and love. Like, I don't know, maybe you get a job offer that takes you away. You got a decision here. Gemini. This could have to do with that karmic release. I feel like you're being tested. That's why the devil's here. All right. Tell me about the lovers. Two of wands. The lightning stick antenna. That's a moving card. And the lovers is choosing. You may have to choose. It's like, I don't know, between love and work or... I don't know what this is because work is showing up. Ace of Cups. That's crazy. All right. L. Shaman, the medicine healer. Take this one. And the shadow cell. 
the dark inner swamp. So you get some shadow work to do. This is all related to the karmic release. Okay. This is going to heal your soul. I also feel that some of you have the ability to heal with this shaman. Okay. Um, you will leave the past behind. But there is a decision that is going to... I don't know shift you I feel it's almost like shifting on a timeline well it is it is but I feel like it's pretty big here let's get a kipper on this row for Gemini wow great fortune I almost feel like you don't see what's coming you may feel like you're taking a risk on a decision right and maybe you feel like you're going to lose something. Or maybe you got to give up something when you make this decision. But what you don't see is what's waiting for you. You have no clue what's going to result from this uh, union. You, you really have no clue. But I feel like that's purposeful. You need to have no clue. Because you need to make this decision based on other things. Not this abundance. Not the 3D. Tell me about the devil, the master of lies. What is this? What is this? Are you lying to yourself? Let's see. The emperor, the ruling father. Aries energy. The king of wands, the glowing white stag. Holy schmoly. You could be dealing with a fire sign, an air sign. If you had a question, the answer is no. What does this know about? What's this know about? Six of Swords, the brand new journey. So you're going on a journey. Should should they not go? Like what? The Seven of Pentacles, the rewarded frog. Okay, they're wanting you to be patient. Uh, I feel like, especially with this lover's card here, you may have more than one offer here. And I just feel like it's, it's a case of don't settle. You need to be patient. So when you make a decision to move on and move forward, okay, this is a pretty big decision. <laughs> Uh, because it's like there's multiple roads, there's multiple paths in front of you. Which one are you going to take? The devil is here because you may be tempted by some that really aren't for you. Not knowing that there's fortune underneath one of them. Who is this emperor to Gemini? Ace of Wands. So this is somebody that you're passionate about. The Emperor. Give me another one on the Seven of Pentacles here. Being patient. The Sacred Fire. Rebirthing Bonfire. All right. I feel like you need to have this karmic release before you make any decisions, Gemini. You really need to cleanse within. You need to do some shadow work. Uh, this is why the devil's here as well. You need to find this peaceful space within. So I feel like this no is no, not yet. Not yet. It's not time. The time will come. That's a big yes. The time will come. And it will be well worth the wait. It's saying well worth the wait. So be patient. Wow. A oh, false person. And that's one of these peeps. So mm, let me see. Because I feel like the King of Wands, the Emperor, are two different people. Pathway. See? Let me see the intentions of... What's the intentions of the Emperor? The intentions of the Emperor. The Magician, the Alchemical Master. Let me get another one because that could be tricky. The Nine of Wands, the Darkness Before the Dawn. One more on the emperor. Yes. Okay. 
So the Emperor may be, yes. What about the King of Wands? What's the intentions of the King of Wands? Hmm. The Page of Cups, the Sister of Rises, Judgment, the Transcendence. Who is this false person then? The Fool, the Eternal Vagabond. All right, I don't feel any... Oh, what about the Devil? The Four of Pentacles, the Prudent Mountain Goat. All right, this Devil, there may be a... Yeah, Four of Cups, the High Priestess, the Secret. Okay, so the Four of Swords. So this Devil is hiding something. Could be a Capricorn. This person is hiding something. The Aries, the King of Wands, all good. But false person is the devil. They're hiding something. You need to listen to your intuition, okay? They may be from the past. They're trying to distract you from these other offers from your path, which is on the bottom of the deck. So tell me about this devil. Mm, they see you uh, as a privileged lady, gift and imprisonment. It's like they mm, they want to trap you here. That's what I'm getting. And they could be careful. They may give you a gift. Tricky, tricky. I'm telling you. So be careful. So there may be three offers that I'm seeing here. Could be more, but there is a choice. That could be the concern. I don't know. Wow. Okay. So, oh, I still need to clarify the Page of Pentacles. Use the Page of Pentacles here. Ace of Swords. Oh my gosh. Ace of Swords, Clarity and Truth, the Six of Cups. And the Three of Cups, the Trinity Triangle. So this is the past and the present. I don't know how many are from the past, how many are from the present. The Three of Swords, one of them broke your heart. The Empress, the Alchemical Mother, could be a Taurus or a Libra. Tell me about the Three of Cups, uh, the Three of Swords, sorry. Sage. It's like... Mm, this heart needs to be healed. What about the Empress? El Caution, the Heedful Mouse. Beware. Taurus or Libra, possibly. Could be any sign. All right, what's their intention? The Empress here. King of Pentacles, the Father of Rises. Stability. I feel like, Gemini, you're going to get a lot of offers, a lot of offers. And this may cause mm, concern because of all of this. Now, you've got to be cautious, I would say. You need to listen to your intuition here, big time. You need to go with that. Don't rush into it, okay? They're saying time will tell. You'll know. They're saying you'll know when to go. That rhymes. Accomplishment and preparation. Remember past accomplishments as a way to overcome present self-doubt. 26 is an 8. An 8 is abundance and preparation. Luck comes most often to the person in place where preparation, opportunity, and skill meets. You may have a 12, which is a 3. That is manifestation. Eight and three are 11. 11 is a psychic number. It's a master number. Use your intuition. Prepare for whatever it is you need to prepare for. Um, you, you'll know. They're saying you'll know. Okay, so you've got to keep moving forward, Gemini, all right? All right, Gems. I hope that resonates. Please drop a like below. Share and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading, let me get you a crystal. Link is in the description box below. You got two, black coral, light in the darkness, and sunstone, raw light radiant. Work on your root chakra 
and carry a protection stone with you, Gemini. Uh, please click on the link below if you are interested in a reading, as there are many impersonators about. Know that you'll see my face in the video if you order a reading from me, as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Have a great day, Gemini, and I'll catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.